Joel. RP Thor here. So let's talk about all of the faces that you see on YouTube, Rumble, Instagram. Oh, there's so many. The logarithm's going to feed you so much information. If you're interested in helping yourself, there is a plethora of people that are willing to help you and tell you all of these things. Most of it's free, but the best stuff is always paid, right? At least it seems like that. I mean, there's some guys that throw a lot of stuff out there for free that's pretty amazing. I mean, dang, look at Alex Harmuzi. He, he throws out a lot of serious stuff for free, um, and he can afford to do so. Uh, but there's a whole plethora of other gurus out there. And why should I listen to you, Thor, on anything that you say? You're just this old guy in his 60s that's half a decent shape, that's lived a lot of life in many ways that can't be described here on YouTube. And why should I listen to you? You fucking shouldn't listen to me. <laughs> you should not believe anything you hear, and you should only believe half of what you see. This is an old Viking thing, and it is more important now than ever before, uh, especially as I get in this parking lot and I'm going to go into Costco. I better not believe everything I read in there or half of what I see, or I'll buy the whole store. Um, so when it comes to gurus... And all of that nonsense and listen to people on the internet. I've said a lot of stuff and sometimes I stumble over my words just like anybody would. And sometimes it doesn't come out the way I actually want to say it. This happens with everybody. So if you're listening to this and you want to get some advice, how do I know I'm not being grifter? Or this guy isn't bullshitting me. You don't. Unless you have something to reference this to and you have it right here. If you can read and you can put two and two together and have decent mathematical skills and you understand the basis for statistical averages and probabilities, you can look at somebody's results. And even if they're small, you can still extrapolate what they're telling you is on the right track or partly on the right track or total bullshit. So... Am I telling you to listen to me? No. Go find out for yourself. Uh, you can listen to me for entertainment, ideas. What I should be giving you is ideas that you can implement and put into action yourself. There's nothing wrong with that. Take an idea, test it by action. So anything I say that might sound like a prescription is not. It's an idea that I've either implemented myself or I've witnessed implemented in uh in reality and I've seen some outcomes if you see an outcome that seems successful I might want to imitate it and us humans are really good at imitating so that's what I would like you to do is look at what I said as an idea that you can put into action and see if it works for yourself and that's what I loved about Brazilian Jiu Jitsu it did the same thing it says okay show me what works in a fight this is reality. That's objective reality. It doesn't matter whether I believe in Ki or ultimate power or Tai Chi. Show me in a fight what works. And if it works, we keep it. And if it doesn't, we move on. It's that simple. So when looking for a guru, use the same philosophy. What am I offering you other than some ideas that you can take for yourself, put them into action, maybe some wisdom that you can apply that works in your life and the more of those that you can put into action and see results the more you'll know that what I'm bringing to you has been tested and has been attested in the arena and shown to work hope that makes sense next time I'm RP Thor